Hello, everybody. Welcome back to not JJ Rick's Rides with Weibo. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> After four years, we are finally doing an FSD video uh, with the wonderful Ollie from Autonomy Central here. Hello. Thank you so much. You're good. <laughs> You're good. Um, yeah, it's sweet. He's got a Tesla, and we are gonna we're gonna hang out uh, kind of in the Phoenix Tempe area. So uh, yeah, sounds like fun. All right, let's have it right, navigate yeah. the IKEA parking lot. Yes. Yeah, ready to set off. All right, here we go. All these people come. I can't decide which way it wants to go. Yeah. And then, so this is not like my first time with FSD, but it's pretty much my first time, sort of. So you got you got better uh, intuition on what's happening here. So if you see anything, I'll I'll totally shout it out. I'll be sure to. But um, I'm not going to do, um, we're not going to shoot for full zero intervention. Hmm. Um, if it's safe, right. I'll, I'll let it try. Yeah. Um, if it's not especially safe, then I will definitely take over. Yeah, just as like an expectations upfront kind of thing here. Definitely, yeah. So, yeah. I'm just, I'm just excited to try this at all, honestly. So. <laughs> well, good. Uh, right off the bat, good uh I good just pressed the accelerator here. Okay, good. Sweet, very sweet. Sorry, I was gonna wait for her, but she didn't. She was waiting for us, and it was kind of a little bit awkward. <laughs> it, is, it is nice that you can give it that little nudge. Yeah. So I'm gonna try not to do anything else. I'm sorry, I just kind of did that instinctively. That's okay. Oh, that's my bad. Sorry, guys. Because um, Waymo has a nice little place to kind of stick the tripod down. I'm Usually I can just hands off with the camera, but uh, not with this. That, that's okay, guys. Still get used to it. But, um, sorry, let me know if my GoPro is blocking your vision at all. No, it's all good. Okay. I mainly use these blind spot cameras, to be honest, for ah, side. Fair, fair. And then I'll just check out the window for other stuff. Nice. Sorry oh. if you guys can see my my head. <laughs> uh, I think they shouldn't be able to. I'll, I'll try and make sure. Okay, cool. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So from my my kind of first impressions takeaways here is it's hmm, well you know it's it's uh, pretty zippy on uh, like acceleration of course you know, coming coming away from. Well, when we when we started from my house, it was like, boom, <laughs> straight off. Straight off the stop sign. I was like, yeah. oh my goodness, that was crazy. <laughs> um, and there's uh, and the speed matching is interesting as well. If someone pulls in front uh, with the braking, but that's like just my first rudimentary thoughts. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know how much either of those things are as important, but anyway. Yeah. So here we go out onto the main roads. 45 miles an hour and then straight away putting its foot down yeah but lane change I'd say this is a reasonable speed what do you think yeah I think so yeah so where are we headed today yes so we are kind of just we're, we're gonna enjoy the uh, lack of geofence here in ODD uh, by going to ASU and the airport uh, terminals, because we, you and I just did a terminals video together. We did, it would uh, be interesting to compare, definitely. If you guys haven't seen that, definitely check it out. Um, Have it linked in the top right, yeah. Yes, <laughs> in, info card. Um, yeah, I, hmm, does it have a, maybe I'll use a Tesla stoplight icon for the countdown. Mm. That's because I'm still using the Waymo Gen 4 one. Just funny. but anyway, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna see if we can kind of co uh, coast around the ASU Tempe campus a little bit, um, and then and then head to the airport, and then we'll see if we can throw in some freeway as well. Even though notably this is 12.3.6, I yes. believe. Yes. Let me put that on the screen. Um, so there yes. you go. 12.3.6. Um, so yeah, not not any of the, not the crazy. 12.5 stuff, but this is still pretty lit, uh, as 
the kids say. <laughs> so. Hardware 3 gang, unfortunately. Yeah. So Shout out to Hardware 3 gang. Yep. That's it. I do, I do really enjoy the, the visualization with, especially the distance and see with just cameras. Mm -hmm. And, well, you know, not, not that, I mean, it's, it's not actually zoomed that far out, of course, but um, it, it is interesting to see. Um, it's like pinpointing locations of cars and just with cameras. Because I, I'm, of course, you know, we're used to the the Waymo visual as well. But, you know, just comparing the two is is interesting. Because seeing how much of the environment it's picking up on with just well, you know, I don't know. I <laughs> without without like right radar or lidar or anything, right? Yeah, exactly. This is, sorry, this is a really basic video already. I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm totally out of my element. This is great. <laughs> That roundabout was pretty good. That was pretty good. No complaints there. Yeah. We are now going... Okay, it's decided to slow a little bit more. Yeah, get down to that 40, roughly a little bit higher. Auto max. Yes, it's for quite indecisive, the auto max. Sometimes it will go 10 over, sometimes it will go 5 below. Mm. Yeah. Do you notice any patterns? Um, other cars, usually. Mm. Um, it will fixate like this person here has decided to, to go just above their speed um, I think anyway because we can't really tell there's no indication of what it's looking at right um, but yeah and empty roads it gets a lot more nervous on what it's supposed to be doing because it, it doesn't have a point of reference of someone else to compare itself to right so it's hit or miss I haven't noticed any specific patterns other than those things fair enough fair enough I do really like the camera. And the, I know that's probably just like a normal feature of Tesla, but no, I, I, I like it too. <laughs> when the camera comes up, this is today, and Joel finally rides in a Tesla for the second time and figures out what all the features are. <laughs> um, you know, good times. Uh, no, it'd be good for the video too because people will be able to see. Yeah. Oh yeah. That. I have wanted to do that in Waymo videos is use the 360 to look out one of the back left windows, but mm. it's so tinted and so small that you can't really see anything at all, so I've, I've just never done it. And if you put anything on the outside of the car, Waymo's not going to be happy with that. And so. that too, yeah. So. I just want to point out, um, we were on average, I've just put it onto assertive, so we can see the full capability, I guess. Sweet. I forgot to change that earlier, I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know, I, in terms of ride smoothness and general capability, I don't know exactly what I was expecting in terms of, because, you know, there's only so much that comes across on video, mm -hmm. um, so I'm really, really feeling the acceleration curves and the braking and stuff, but I would say it's not, of course it's not the same as Waymo, but it, in some ways it feels similar, I mean, and then in some ways it's like, good driving is only so many different variations, Right. you know. Um, I would say it's a lot more jerky than Waymo, mm -hmm. but then again, I've got into one Waymo car that was so jerky, it was oh. like abnormally jerky, Yeah. Uh, so... Oh my goodness. Yeah. Did you get that on video? I did not. Ah, oh, okay. It was specifically in that IKEA parking lot that we just left. Oh, I see. It I was see. like, uh, uh, and there was no one around, <laughs> so... Oh my goodness. Yeah, there's that, um, in the video that's probably coming out before this one, where I, I ride with the first time Waymo rider. He, uh, we were in that 38th Street and Washington Park and Ride where you and I stopped. Yes. Um, and coming around the corner by some trees, it was really having some trouble with like empty nothingness. We, we didn't know what was going on. Uh, so that, that's interesting. But hey, we should try it. <laughs> yeah. With this, this is what it does. Yeah, I, um, oh, and there's also the, I was, when my mom and I were done shooting that uh, top part of the Waymo service area video, we went back to the same uh, parking lot, and then she took a Waymo almost all the way to, the, to home. And on the on the way there, her Waymo was swerving in and around the lanes. Oh. And then it actually got pulled over. By the cops? <laughs> By the cops. Oh, um, you get it on film. <laughs> then, yeah, we didn't, we didn't end up getting it. Um, but then eventually, I guess the, the cop just left without actually doing anything. Oh, so the cops um, didn't even speak to them? Yeah, not, oh. not at all. Um, which is interesting.
interesting. Um, but the way it was acting erratic, and as far as we can tell, there wasn't anything in terms of, well, you know, there was that whole video with the, the truck with a trailer with trees on it. Yes. And then, um, or like a, a tow truck with a, a, a towing a, a, a car that's swinging back and forth, like anything like, there wasn't anything like that. So I would, it would be nice if that was on video, but... <laughs> Maybe some, the cop just wanted to see if that was a safe drive yeah, in prison. Yeah, some things are not to be, but yeah, I, I bet the cops love Waymo. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen a lot of accounts on like Reddit and stuff though, the pedestrians, they, they, they like Waymo because it always yields to them and they know yes. they can cross the street in front of it and stuff like that. I, I do, that does make my heart warm and fuzzy, mm -hmm. is that seeing people realize how nice Waymo is to them. So I don't know if the cops have the same kind of, oh, we're Ooh. drifting a little bit. Ooh. I don't, I was about to, sorry, I don't know what I was saying. I was about to say, <laughs> um, isn't this where you filmed the, filmed the Railroad April Fool's video? Uh, it was farther south of this, but it's the same, oh. tr same tracks. So, oh, okay. Yeah. Um, um, I was saying, I don't know if the cops appreciate it for the same reason, because they're like <laughs> pretty law-abiding or whatever. This right. is risky. Oh, it wasn't too bad. Okay. Yeah. That was cool. Slightly, slightly occluded view. Yeah. Um, pretty good. Yeah. I do like how it's, how quick it is mm. with the... Yeah. It doesn't mess around. It is. <laughs> yeah, good way of putting it. So. So still being on 12.3.6 for people watching, um, there's no full attention monitoring system. I still have to apply pressure to the wheel to um, get it to move, or to dismiss the, the nag here, as you can see. I just have to do that, and the nag goes away. Right. But in the new version, it uses this camera up here um, to detect whether you're paying attention or not. And if it can figure out that you are paying attention, you won't get these wheel nags. Nice. Very nice. Which we're eagerly waiting for the update. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, the timing with 12.5 is it's not quite there, but no. it's, a, it's okay. Who knows, we might get it tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, this is still really cool. Okay, so yield sign across the tracks and with cars coming from the left here. Um, oh, wow, yeah. Wow. There you go. There you go. That's incredible. Cool. An immediate lane change. Right across. That is one of the most assertive things I've seen it do. <laughs> That's crazy. Nice. Then stick around because we're going to hit a Terminal 4. Mm. It's going to be sweet, guys. <laughs> We'll pull right up to the terminal and then do a pull out like Waymo does, right? Yeah. Yeah. Except uh, even better because Waymo doesn't go to the departures, it goes to the bright chair. Mm. So it departures is insane. There's like a million, billion cars. Um, well, we can't decide where it wants to go into that suicide lane. There we go. Nice. It's been pretty solid so far, actually. I would agree. Yeah. Pretty sweet. Okay, Mill Avenue. Yeah, we're getting farther and farther into Tempe craziness when it comes to the traffic. Um, so it should start to heat up as we go here. Let's move the specialization stuff out. So, its view is actually. I would say a little bit more limited than Waymo. Mm. It shows more on the screen, but it actually sees less. Because it shows, I think the Waymo vi visualization is a little bit more like this. Yeah. Whereas, like, that's as far as it can see. Gotcha. Nice. But it's still pretty impressive what it can see with just the camera. Yeah, I do like that the scooter still had a walking animation, but it was just <laughs> really sped up. Yeah. This is like running across the road at light speed. <laughs> Waymo will still show the pedestrian as, a, a, or a scooter as a pedestrian, but because it's using the, the point cloud, it's not actually an animation, it's just reality. Yes. Yeah. Um, yeah. Okay, not bad.
bad. We did go over the right line a little bit, but mm. possible. And a bit of a shift to the left. There we go, picking back speed. I was trying to decide how fast I wanted to go, I think. renders it as one long car. Mm. <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. Okay, unprotected left. Good creep, good creep. Yep. It's not showing a creep blind, but I don't think it does that anymore, I'm not mistaken. Look at that. Oh my goodness. <laughs> that is beautiful. <laughs> Alright, full stop. Oh, now it's a truck. I can't decide what it is. No, now it's backwards. Now it's 
Yeah, hesitate a little bit. What, what are we doing? Whoop. Driving in the bike lane, okay. Yeah. <laughs> it hesitated a little bit for those people over there because I wasn't sure what they were doing. But it proceeded pretty nicely, but I would say that that driving in the bike lane is uh, not great. Yeah. So on your right is ASU Gamage. All the fun musicals happen. Yeah, I saw Fiddler on the Roof there once. That was pretty good. Cool. Uh, See, that's a bus now. Now it's a bus. Oh, accordion bus. Stretchy. Oh, no, now it's gone. <laughs> bye bye, bus. <laughs> I guess it depends on the length of it. Right. Yeah. Now in proper follow mode kind of traffic here. Yeah. You can see it, that one's gone darker, mm -hmm. which means it's just directly in front of it or it's following it. Or cool. Well, the streetcar's coming to our left. Let's see how it's rented. It's a truck. <laughs> nice. I mean, at least it shows it. Yeah. That's that's good. Why are we still? Why is it stopped all the way back there? Are we in its way? No, it's got tons of room. And it's actually keeping to the right for it. Pretty up, good. Up our lane. I did not. Yeah, Waymo does that as well, but it's really hard to notice unless you really pay attention to it. Mm. Uh, oh, I was stopped at the station, that's why. Ah, <laughs> oh, gotcha, gotcha, yeah, yeah. It's getting busy. still not really in the bike lane, thankfully, but yep. just on the edge there. It didn't make any indication it was going to change lanes there today. It was just like, <laughs> oh, guess I have to. And now this person's trying to... Oh, gosh. <laughs> this is going to be fun. <laughs> This is embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> See, it's different in Waymo because you're just sat in the back going, oh, you know what, it's fine, it's not my, really my problem. Yeah. But when you're sat in the driver's seat, it is your problem. <laughs> it's like, oh dear, yeah. Okay, it's so almost there, yeah. Here it, okay, green light. Here it comes. Moment of truth. Ooh. Oh, they let us in. Good, good show. Sure. All right. Okay, yeah, that was alright. Yeah. Just creep forward and there you go. And so this is, yeah, this is about around the um, yeah, brick, brickyard on mill, like engineering buildings and stuff. I, um, so good, plenty of good pedestrian stuff going on. Nightlife was good, I think. Uh, Let's just check out yeah. this pin. Yeah, so I threw it on the roundabout. I don't remember exactly which video it was. It was probably in the late 90s somewhere, early one, early 100s. But I think I, I threw a... This is one of the Waymo drop-off points as well. Oh, okay. I, I've done before. I don't remember which video. But, um, like, for some reason, it was interesting once, and then it had it figured out every time after, so I'm not actually sure there's too much crazy going on, but... We'll see what FSD has to say. Yeah. Right, I'm going to have to be quick on taking the pin off on this one, so I'm sorry if I interrupt everyone's visualization. <laughs> yeah. Nice and confident. Yoink. Wait for this camera to go away, and... Boom. Nice, so yeah, somebody... Can, so we're going to just have to squeeze around it. On the left here, tracks on the right. That's Ooh. a little bit close. <laughs> <laughs> yep. It did it confidently, it, but. It did it. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah. It likes to get close, doesn't it? <laughs> it just doesn't quite have the same confidence with distance. I mean, or I, I wouldn't. Uh, because we don't have true distance with LiDAR, but it's still... Well, you know. It's yeah. more precise than, than this. Right. Because you, you get the whole close but don't touch thing. Okay, we're in the middle of um, two lanes right now. Yeah. So we're gonna we're gonna go for a right here. See uh, what happens. Get one massive car again. <laughs> nice. See, this person wants to turn left, and we're in the way. Oh man. So I'm gonna get out that way. Nice. It's saying that bike lane is a drivable lane from the looks of things. Oh. So. Let's see what happens. Yeah. See, it shows a line here, but I don't know if it's seeing it as a bike lane or what, really. People in the comments can be like, why did you disengage? <laughs> yeah. We're, we're, gonna, we're taking it a little bit easier here. No. Yeah, we're not trying to uh, get in anyone's way. Yeah. So it was creeping a little bit. We're now sat in this crosswalk. Um, it can't decide what it wants yeah. to Here we have the green light, but yeah. there's loads of people crossing. Lane. That's a disengage. Yeah. Or is that a bus? That's the bike lane. Yeah. Yeah, I wanted to try and drive in that bike lane. That would have been funny though. <laughs> <laughs> get to the end where it gets really narrow there, and then go. Oh crap! What's the... <laughs> no, yeah, we're not. We're not out here for the. No. Lulls. Oh, we kind of are out here for the lulls, but not really. We're not trying to get a ticket. <laughs> no, 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 no. no let's, let's not do that. It would make for a good title, a good thumbnail, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. but not worth the cost. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that looks fancy. Oh, what is it? It's, uh, I always have to Google lens my Tesla models. Cause, uh, uh, yoink. Let's see. Oh, that's a Model S over there, the white one. But that would be my first guess, yeah, Model S. I almost want to say plaid, but I can't really see it. But it's difficult to tell. There we go. Uh, okay, I can't really see a plaid badge. I don't know, anyway, it looks fancy. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, that yeah, was quick, quick stop. Okay, because there's um, traffic on the other side. It's, okay. We'll happily sit on the intersection. <laughs> yeah. It tries, but... That's one thing Waymo's really good at, is yeah. not sitting in the intersection. And when it does um, not do it, it's quite smooth. Yeah. Whereas this, if it sees, it might have to stop at the intersection and it hasn't crossed it yet, mm. it will slam on the brakes to stop before the line. Ah, okay. Which is not the best. <laughs> Oh, okay. 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 Yeah, I'm into it. We just seem to be kind of rolling. Interesting. Now it's committed to it. Very interesting. Okay, now we're at the uh, the light rail streetcar crossover here. We are kind of sat in the intersection though. Yeah, luckily the uh, light rail has a stop signal, so... Yeah. Uh... <laughs> This is stupid. Sketchy. Toasty. Toasty. <laughs> sat on the train tracks. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Please.
Uh, <laughs> it just gets progressively longer as we get closer. It's, that's great. Yeah. I swear this is a way more preferred route, this bridge, or one of the ones next to it. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's a way more right over there. Yeah, on the other side. Hello, way more. Hey. <laughs> especially in SF, it should have like a tour. Oh yeah. Where it goes to all these different landmarks and tells you about them. It does exist, by the way. It exists? Yeah. It's um... No, we don't even want to stop. Uh, ooh! I just pushed that oh, through. Oh, you pushed it? Okay, yeah. good. Because we would have stopped in the intersection. Yeah. It's a... Uh, I uh, may or may not have seen something about the inner workings of the Waymo app, APK. Okay. On, on Android, and in the strings file, there's a whole bunch of text mentioning tours so oh, I don't know if that's ever going to be a thing but uh, it definitely should because I know a lot of tourists do use NSF it looks like they thought of it yeah so I say roll it out guys definitely <laughs> that's it yeah yeah I pushed it through that intersection because otherwise we would have been stuck in a crosswalk fair 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 as much as I'd love to do it for the video, I'm not going to drive dangerously to yeah, have an intervention free drive. Yeah, not do that. Yeah. yeah. Light rails. Hmm. Well, it'd be nice if there's light rail interaction here, but. Uh, but it's all intersection controlled, isn't it? Right, right. to shoot that video with the, the friend of mine who never tried Waymo. Uh, we were coming off the freeway and then I had my trip set up from before I started going right. uh, to the parking lot and so I was just ready to hit, hit the button, request my button, as soon as we were within range. Um, and so I did that and it turned out we got the Waymo we were driving right next to. So oh, for, nice. For like five minutes I got to drive next to the Waymo that was going to the same place. As we sat at a stoplight for like five minutes, as two light rail trains kept interrupting this, the light cycle. So it was hilarious. <laughs> at least they have priority. Yeah. They don't have priority in LA. Yeah. Oh, man. I mean, it, it makes sense, right? They have way more people on them, so. Yeah. I mean, sure. Definitely. I, I would agree, it makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we're getting some freeway action. Here we go. Alright, important to note this still runs V11 for freeways. V11, okay. Uh, no AI. End-to-end -end AI stuff. It's literally just code. Uh, oh, are we well, going on the freeway? Wait, never mind. Well, we'll see if we can get some freeway later on. Uh -huh. Oh yeah. Okay. Uh, still got up to high speed there. So yeah. Is there a, is there a noticeable? Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> oh. Okay. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Is there a noticeable shift when it goes switches uh, modes? Like uh, in behavior, yes, but like the second it happens, no. Okay. Because um, the AI end to end AI stack will put it into the first lane. Ah. It will change lanes first, and then it's kind of in its lane, and then it switches. Got it. So it won't switch in the middle of like something happening. Mm. Yes, we are going on the freeway, actually. Oh, nice. 
Yep. Oh, yeah, a, yeah. a little bit. Yeah, because there's that. It transitions to the terminal. Yeah. Well, no, I don't think we are actually. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. There you go. Or, yeah, some, something similar ish. Yeah. yeah. 143 south for like five seconds. Okay, yeah, so um, we are we are in, in um, V11 freeway stack right now. Because ah. I have a max speed control. Ah, okay. So, yeah. Oh, no, we're back into. That was a very strange shift. Huh. Yeah, we're back into Ento and AI right now. Oh, is that the light rail depot? I believe so, yes. Sweet. Yeah. Okay, I think they have a new rolling stock, like new, like a new Siemens uh, something or other. Yeah, oh, gotcha. Uh, that's that's kind of crazy. It was uh, with Michael Worley uh, trying out down, Wave of Downtown Phoenix the first day it was available. And then on the way back to my car, I got on one of the light rail trains and it was just totally different than the usual one. Oh, you're so like, like, what happened? I was like, what is this? <laughs> so I guess it was the, the new ones, but mm -hmm. I don't know if they've actually planned on transitioning to fleet or anything. I haven't actually paid attention. Yeah. Um, but, yeah. <laughs> anyway, Sky Harbor, here we come. Uh, yeah, there we go, Sky Train. So we are we're taking that alternate way in. Um, we'll see if we can spot any waybos while we're here, because I do believe since we shot that video, daytime terminal has almost, almost, almost like publicly rolled out, but not quite. Still not to my account. <laughs> oh, okay, not quite. I, a couple of people I know got it, so, but it was, yeah, so it's still going, uh, I guess. But. The only reason I got to do it was because I, it was before 5 a.m. Ah. I actually, um, set the trip up before then. Oh, okay. I actually arrived at 5.15 and it was cool with it. <laughs> so... Nice. Um, but I did get dropped off at the wrong terminal, not for any fault of Waymo, for oh. the fault of the Frontier app that told me it was Terminal 4. Oh, Even yeah. though they don't fly out of Terminal 4. No, yeah, Terminal 3 for Frontier, yeah. Yep. Uh, okay, yeah, this is, so Waymo would have gone off to the left there. This is, we're going up to a higher level. We don't want to park. Um, yeah, we don't want to do that, yeah. So this is... In an ideal world, we would attempt a curb pull over here, but um, don't want to be too crazy about it. So it's thinking about it. Yeah. Shall I pull it over and then? Because it looks like he wants to make a loop. Yeah, if you'd. Uh, I'll if pull you'd it be over. Down for that. Yeah. And then um, see if we can make pull it pull out. out. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. Sorry, let me bump the exposure. There we go. Okay, I had it on manual for... Anyway. Okay, let me pull it up to the curb. Oh, cool, yeah. Make it as difficult for it as we can. <laughs> <laughs> Give it plenty of room to pull out. And... Bingo. Engage. This is our last destination, though. Oh, okay. Yeah. Got it. So, we oh, might... Yeah. Do we want to set up anything before we... Uh, we might need to add another stop. Going? Should we just stop at the curb here for a second and figure that out? Yes, that's Maybe. a good idea. Okay. Okay. Okay, that brings us to the end of this video then. So, uh, thank you very much everyone for watching. Uh, come back next time for more FSD content. Heck yeah. See you later. <laughs> Bye.